Oh, that's Mr. Explosive TV here, and today I'm going to show you how to, make, uh, how to get unlimited money in Far Cry 3. And the first thing you're going to do is you're going to download a program called Cheat Engine. So if you just go on the internet, type on Cheat Engine, go to this on CheatEngine.org because I'm pretty sure that any other um, like things that you download them from is probably going to be a virus. So go to Cheat Engine thing, downloads, download Cheat Engine 6.2. page should look like this. Don't download it from any other things, or I suggest not to. But um, then you're going to need Far Cry 3, of course, <clears throat> and you're going to want to launch Far Cry 3. Did I say Far Cry 2? I meant Far Cry 3, if I said Far Cry 2. This way is how I got all my stuff. I got this, this. Oh, I got that thing for free. I got the attachments on this, and uh, nothing on that. But you're going to come over here and look at my 5,837. So press Alt Tab, and it'll take you back to your desktop. Run Cheat Engine, and then go over here to this to find a process. Find the uh, click the window list because it'll make it much easier if I Far Cry 3. Far Cry 3 right here, double-click it. So it pulls up this, doesn't really do anything. So you're going to type in however much money you had, and I forgot how much money I had. 5,837? Yeah, okay. And then click first scan. And then you get all this. And so you're going to have to single out which one of them is your money value, so back into Far Cry 3, and you can buy or sell something. And I lag like crazy, and if I go back into the game, right? Oops, can't really look into that. So I'm just gonna click sell. So now I have $5,944. So I click that, $5,944, next scan. It's going to be these three values. Um, should only be two, so I have to go back in here. And I'm just going to sell. I don't really need that. Was it 5,944? Yeah, okay. And then now 5,964. Oh, okay, so they are all the same. And you're going to have to find which one. I don't think it really matters, but I tried it before. And so now you can just set it to your max. It's, it's in your wallet, 6,000. Value is six thousand, and then if you want to, you can just click this right here, and it'll keep your money the same. And it will go down and up in certain places whenever you buy certain things. Or I don't know, it's weird, but I'm not going to do that because I don't feel like. It. So now I only have, I still only have five thousand nine hundred sixty-four. So I'm going to leave this, save my game, go back in here, and then I'm going to like sell something else, sell it, and I didn't do it that time, so then I have to open up a different one. Hit OK. Go back into your game. Bag like crazy. Open this. Sell something else. OK. Now, let's see. 5,999. It should be successful. Now. So then you have to go back into here. I'm just going to change this one. I don't know what it, the problem is. Maybe I should just go. And so I'm just trying to buy an attachment for this thing. Back, back, back. Okay. See, 
okay, so it's frozen effect doesn't have anything yet. And that's how you get a lot of money in Far Cry 3. Heck, you can also do this with Call of Duty Zombies. Um, <coughs> and Flash games. Flash games, I'm pretty sure it only works in Firefox. It's just weird if you try to use Google Chrome. It will, like, pull up this weird, like, 20,000 processes here. I'll show you. So, for Google Chrome, got Google Chrome open, find a process, and then there's like a, there's like 20 Google Chrome processes. And you'll have to do a bunch of complicated stuff to do that. Or you can just, like, run Firefox. This is the only reason I have Firefox is to use it on Flash games if I feel like it. And, and, oops, open Cheat Engine back up. And keep quiet. And then there's only one of them for Firefox, and then there's a plugin container. And what you want to use is plugin container. And thanks for watching. Uh, hope you enjoy this. Hope this helps.